Hi, so this is a quick tip for uh, getting and using the Adobe Pixel Bender plugin for Adobe Photoshop. Um, for CS5, this does not work in CS6. They have not done it yet, unless um, I'm mistaken. So you come to this page and then you download the Pixel Blender plugin and then click the checkbox let's say that you've read and agreed to the terms and then you go down and you do the 32 bit or 64 bit you download it and it will be an MXP file and from there you need to open up your Adobe CS5 you get your extend, stall crit, extend script toolkit no you don't you get your Adobe extension manager right click on it and run it as administrator yes and then that's going to open and from there you choose to install and first of all you go on to Adobe Photoshop CS5 64 32 bit depending on which one you downloaded go install it will go open up your browser you find it so I've got it set to download and you choose it you click open and it'll ask you to accept it and then it'll install it okay once you've got it we start Photoshop open. I've got this image open. Now it's best not to have too large an image size, otherwise it can cause problems. You come to filter, you come to pixel bender, and then pixel pixel bender gallery. Now I find the best one is oil paint, but you go through them. Pixelate's quite nice. That's quite nice. So let's stay with. Um, not kaleidoscope, this style with oil paint and then you've got these options there so you know there's no point in me going through and explain, explaining them you just play with them I like to have it quite clean quite bright not too high a brush scale and not too much um, brush contrast so maybe something like that you could process on a GPU or not um, my GPU ain't too bad so I'm going to say OK and then click OK and there you have it remember you can fade it we could have actually that converted it for a smart object and that would have allowed us to fade it whenever we want but we'll do an edit fade oil paint and you can bring the opacity down you could change change the blend mode you know whatever you want to do you can do so that's the pixel bender toolkit and how to where to get it how to install it and briefly how to use it thanks for watching